I've said it before and I'll say it again. These folks have ruined the experience for their fellow customers and those working in these jobs. Horrible, outrageous, should be charged for the damage. My favorite comment, though, was this. Would she like some cheese with that wine? Can I ask you guys something? As you are watching all of this go down, what is the thing that would drive you to the point of going berserk in a public place like a grocery store? Which, by the way, best place to go when smoking the chiva it might take you longer to find stuff but it is enjoyable it i'm sorry i might sound old the grocery store is a phenomenal place it is a sacred place i would go there because living in la everything is just so overcrowded a lot of the times i would go first thing sunday morning when no one is there and just stroll because it is the best everything's fresh no one has touched any of that stuff yet which goes to show you how much time the workers put in to have everything lined up and looking good for you when you go in there oh i love it so what would drive you to that point where you are ruining that for everybody and not just ruining it okay you are going in there and breaking bottle after bottle after bottle of wine. The profits are going up, so those people don't really care. Um, but my question is, what what would what would make you do that? Why would you do that? Like we've seen so many of these videos, right, where someone is just losing it because of one thing or another. I remember seeing a dad in a store yelling at another customer, mouthing off to that other customer. They're like 20 feet from each other. You MF or blah, blah, blah. And then getting picked up by his kids. When does someone, because this looks like a person who's in their 30s, 40s, probably 40s, when does it hit you that you are officially at rock bottom? I, I am really curious because I, I think that's it. <laughs> Comment below. We'll see you soon.